All right, welcome to a Guild Wars Golem video. These videos are made for me so that I can remember what I was doing in Guild Wars uh, way back in the day. Uh, if you don't like it, well, then don't watch. All right, so this one is about the jumping puzzle. Um, I filmed all three slots. Here I go. I'm going off from the Qui-Gon. And um, there I'm jumping. Right there, you can get uh, your head stuck. And I'm jumping. And those candy cane bars are a little bit tricky. Um, this is all filmed on the day of uh, release. I. Uh, I finished it pretty quickly, about maybe 20 minutes into it or something like that. So it really didn't take that long to finish it. Um, I like the three paths. I thought um, that was a good way to go. And well, it wasn't that. It wasn't as hard as uh, the clock tower. I thought. Um, yeah, it was, it was good. It was a good puzzle right here. Oh, and I died. And I didn't know I could die there. And I also died at the at the snowballs. But um, yeah, that was just one thing that I didn't know about. So, um, I. Th I found out, uh, I think the first day, that um, the presence in the in the in the chest at the end are dependent on your level. So um, I tried to tell that to people. Um, here I am going off of uh, Gingerbread Man, and. Yeah, I was watching uh, some of the other people on YouTube who do uh, Guild Wars um, videos, and I don't know if they stated that outright. Um, it's always best to do it with your highest level uh, character because um, um, the rewards at the end, as far as presents go, were uh, based on your level. Uh, this is my second highest level character, but uh, this one only gets um, large presents, not the level 80 um, giant presents. So, and I don't know where the cutoff point is, so that was kind of bad. Um, I did get a lot of... I tried it with other characters. I got the mediums and the smalls. Uh, the Asura are e easy, of course, to use for jumping puzzles. But, uh, yeah, my highest level Asura isn't a level 80, so. Um, and I run up here and I jump. And I have seen some people, um, or well, just one person managed to run past that that last boulder there and dodge roll enough to get on the side and but uh, and you'll see here that I get the large present so wow he was pretty low level back then but now he's a little bit higher um I think I've gotten him I've raised him about 10 levels or something and here I am with uh, my ranger just showing you the level uh, 80 giant presence. So, um, yeah, a little bit different uh, chest there. Here I go for, I don't know what I'm going to do. Okay, Qui-Gon. Um, they're called Qui-Gon Ribbon. They're not Jedi. Oh, I like um, yeah, I think uh, 
looking down on the on the um, candy cane bars is probably a lot easier way to go. But um, I don't think I did that in any of the video that I shot here. I think I just eyeballed it and um, memory reflexed it. So muscle memory did. Um. Yeah, there are a couple of different ways you can skip a lot of the uh, snowflakes. You can jump across a few, so and you can jump across a few of the um these uh candy cane droplets or whatever they're called, candy cane candies. They're not really candy canes, are they? Um. I think you can dodge roll through that uh, gust of wind also, but I, I know I have received some evade on that, but uh, and I did go down uh, using my ranger down the other way, down to the bottom of the um, of the snowball thing, and which turned out to be nothing, unless I didn't know, you know secret moonstone dwarven door that was down there or something but oh here I am and look I'm gonna go up here and I'm gonna jump off and yeah I don't know if I died before I got into the box but I didn't get anything on that one so that was kind of bad. um yeah, I was trying to do uh, some of the dailies. You know, every day, do uh, do the um, do the jumping puzzle to get the um, karma booster, the boosters, plus the snowflake, plus the present, plus the um, karma vial. So at the beginning they were gulps of karma, and then they turned into flasks of karma, and I'm not really sure which is better, but um, I've been trying to do it every day, trying to get uh, you know all of the prizes that come along with it, but um, yeah, sometimes you know you do it and you don't get anything, and this is. Uh, I've seen uh, other people in the jumping puzzle say the same thing there. I just jumped across. I skipped two of the snowflakes. But, um, and in the chat, sometimes uh, I would group with people and we'd do a race. And the race essentially ends right here. Um, because after that you're controlled by the snowballs not by your jumping speed so um, well yeah I think a lot easier than uh, the clockwork uh, the clock tower and uh, kind of I, I like the different types of gifts in the treasure chest but um, for the most part uh, it was alright but uh, I think it could have been better but a really fun thing so anyway talk to you guys later come by take care